So you've logged in from the first screen. This is the second screen that you'll land on on the FAA rate card app. The two buttons up the top, either side of the word rate card, log out will take you back to the previous screen where you'll have to re-enter your membership number and your password. The reset button to the right will reset all the things that you've selected and bring you back to this very screen here. We now want to select the day that we're currently on. So we're going to go for here and do this. And bring up the 13th of March, which is currently today, on the Sunday, and press done there. We want to select a call time, so let's go to that one there. And we want to select a call time earlier, and it currently is at the moment. 6.23. What type of day are you on? Are you on a standard D, a standard night, or a shift call, or on a fitting, or on a fitting that breaches four hours? Select accordingly. I'm going to stay on standard day. Whereabouts is your postcode on the location relative to the zone bandings on the London Underground tube map? Are you currently in zones 1 to 3 or zone 4 or at one of these given film studios? Or are you even further away than that from the Charing Cross Road station which is where the centre of our radius of our, of our agreement is? Select accordingly and then you have a summarise so far what you've chosen. Categories A to E cover certain things that you might be entitled to on the day or night. If you know the agreement, you know what's behind these letters. I, for the time being, I'm going to choose A and choose a haircut. Press done there. Go back to the next. These are for payments that aren't covered anywhere. Petrol money, meal allowances and anything else that you may require to add into this. Press next. Is the day or night that you're on a continuous? If it is, tap on no, it will turn to yes. Have you been on a nine hour day and your meal break was a bit later than you imagined? Again, tap on the no, goes to yes. What's the end of the day going to be? I'm going to go for 2025. Press next. There's a complete itemised breakdown. There's standard day. The date you've worked, you started slightly earlier than 7 o'clock, it says 6.23. This is the finish time. How many hours you worked altogether? What the rate of pay was for the 9 hour day to start with, the holiday money, the number of hours over time you've worked, the total over time pay that you've been awarded, and then a breakdown as to how that was reached. Then after that there's a supplementary fee for your haircut, and a gross breakdown right there. So. You email that to yourself if you wish by tapping on this button here. You'll generate an email here which you can send to yourself. Or you can log out and go back to square one.